Okay, in this guitar lesson, I'm going to cover the guitar riff in Hot Rod Lincoln as played by the group Commander Cody and his Lost Airmen. Uh, this was a hit back in the early 70s by that group. Okay, it's played in the key of E major, and I have standard tuning on my guitar. And I'll play an E major chord. Okay, this uh, guitar riff, it's just based upon three chords. First, fourth, and fifth. And that's E major, A major, and B dominant seventh, and then back to home, which is E major. Okay, in order to play this guitar riff, you have to double pick real fast. Uh, but if you can't do that fast, that's okay. Uh, you start out slow and you just build up speed very gradually until you're comfortable playing it fast. It may take a while, but uh, if you persevere, it, uh, you'll get it. It starts out on the low E string. Again. Okay, that riff is in uh, E major. And then the next round you play it in A major. You play it just the same way except you're playing it in A major. Which is like this. Okay, now the next round is just played in B major. Same thing, but it's in B major. Okay, when you're playing that riff, I'm picking uh, each note. I'm not doing any hammer-ons or pull-offs. I'm picking every note. Okay, again, I'll play it from E. Okay, this last part here, okay, that part there, that's the only part where I'm doing a pull-off, and that pull-off is done here on the C-sharp and B. I pick it once, and then I pull-off to sound the B. Pick once, pull. Okay, when you're picking, make sure that whichever way you start, which is a downward sweep or an upward sweep, alternate throughout the whole guitar riff. So it's going to be played like this. I'm going to start with a downward sweep. That seems to be more comfortable for me.
again, make sure uh, when, you, when you start with a downward sweep, then the next one is an upward sweep. Okay, here it is played just a little bit faster. Okay, here it is just a little bit faster. Okay, the best way to approach this, if you're not uh, too comfortable with double picking, again, just start out real slow. And I suggest using a metronome too, so you can keep in proper time. Uh, in fact, keep in very strict time with this. Uh, it's in 4-4 four -four time. And uh, just once you get comfortable at that slow speed, then bump your speed up just a little bit and then try taking it a little bit faster. And once you get comfortable at that level, then bring it up, uh, bump it up another notch. Okay, when you're holding the pick, um, just make sure that you hold the pick at an angle on the strings. Don't uh, have your pick flat against the string. It's much harder to control it that way. Hold it at an angle so you're brushing against it. and it will be much easier to control. And also, as you get faster, you'll probably want to lift that pickup so that it's just going lightly over the string so you, so you won't get locked up on there. Okay, that's all for this lesson. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Bye.